some uh, some breaking news coming to us here, viewers. As uh, manager of Terminal FC is is Ben Sports News. Oh, I'll get this out. Get the pictures. Get the cat. Oh, no more pictures, please. Can I sign that for you? Not all. I'm happy to. Oh, blimey. This must be mine. Look at that. Look at the state of that. How long has he had that for? That is looking bad. Pop that down. <sighs> wow. Oh, look at me, viewers. Yeah, that's right. We can talk now because I'm not doing usually just a phone call. Oh, Ben, who's who you signing? Oh, have you got any jobs that you could do for me? No, not anymore. Where is he now? Down there. Hello, FC Thames. Hello. <laughs> What's it like down there? <laughs> He's actually taller than me. So, that is, I'm better looking. So, that's annoying. But no, this is good, isn't it? You know, long gone are the days where I'd be reporting low moves to Warsaw. Oh, he'd be so proud. Hey, Jim, wouldn't you? Look at me. Look at me, manager. Wow. Wow. And what's he doing? Probably putting up some picture frames or something. <laughs> He's honestly loser. Oh, God. Why does Zoom make me look like a steward? What the f is going on? Oh, wait, he's here. Hang on. So, Ben, yeah. I've got some ideas for the supporters club. Mm. Tell me if yes, you, you think do. I'm dreaming too big here. Not possible, Brian. This is what we've been needing. Good ideas. Great ideas. I love ideas. Well, so, here we go. I'm excited, Brian. I can hear it in your voice, Brian. Me so. too. Oh, come on then. Let's have them. <clears throat> he's spot. What? what are you doing? Brian? Brian? What? You were doing the ideas. We were getting excited. Brian. You were... Oh, yeah. Sorry, Ben. Brian! Who's that? Start? Hang on. I think my wife's what? calling me. Oh, fam. Yeah. Everything okay. okay? No, actually, it's not. So sorry. So sorry, honey. On Zoom, mate. I'm, doing uh, I'm just talking with Ben. Librarian oh, sort Ben? Of. What no, you not that one. Cousin Ben? Not that one. Teacher Ben. Uh, uh, no, that one's great. Salesman Ben? Uh, not, yeah, not him. The other one. Ooh, the continue clicking fake manager loser. That's the guy. What, the what do you mean? Brian? 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 Yes, ben? Bro continue clicking fake manager loser. That's a bit, that's not, uh, come on. Sorry, Ben. Continue clicking AFC Tim's manager loser. That's not the bit I've got an issue with. Don't change them. Let's get on with our ideas, Brian. For the love, what on earth is going on? You lot. You lot. First episode of the series. I said, let's go for 7,500 likes. You smashed 9,000 as of recording. Unbelievable. Thank you. And that then brings us to today. Another episode, our first game as AFC Thames manager at a competitive level. And some new players, as you can see, have been brought in. Let's talk you through them all then, as we introduce you to some of the new boys that will take shape in this new look side. So the first man I've decided to bring in is... Someone I know personally these days, uh, Manny, has been brought in. Manny Brown, YouTuber, Twitch streamer, entrepreneur, let's call him. Um, yeah, brought him in. Good option on the right or the left. Probably going to come off the bench and have an impact at some stage. Good agility, good acceleration, great flair. The rest of it is is fine. So, I hope you're watching, Manny. Hi, mate. Check out Manny on YouTube. You may have done already. So, continuing through the team, of course, free transfers is the way to go about this. Uh, Vincente Bello has come in. Uh, look, when you compare him to, to Manny, he's got a little bit more quality to him, probably. Those mental attributes that definitely stand out. The physicals look really good as well. Uh, great, again, great agility, great pace. I think having agility and pace at this level is going to be really important. And you've got to remember as well, like nines and tens, not so bad, actually. As we're here, let's do it now. Let's change what the colours look like for the attributes at this lower level. So a good attribute at this level of football for me is like a 13, uh, an excellent attribute, I should say. A good attribute is around sort of the 9 level on the average we can keep as it is. I've actually got two saves going on at lower levels at the moment, so this is probably going to be helpful. So you can see, slightly improved now with those 10s and 9s uh, taking effect. And we've got ourselves, I think, a, a decent little player here to play in that midfield and could be a big part of the team. New team, new player. Welcome Ryan New, everybody. Uh, looks like a decent defender, lacking stamina, determination, any of 
just ability really lacking ability uh, but Ryan knew again some really nice attributes decision making is really good for this level of football natural fitness is decent pace is okay and you can see the heading marking tackling for a defender at this level it's kind of all I want so um should be should be fine I'm ignoring all the ones there's a lot of ones two balance makes me fearful that as he walks out of the tunnel he will just trip over next up look yeah, I've got I've got a family member Brad Carr not actually related to me, but uh, welcome to Brad. And as you can see, Brad, as a central midfielder, looks really good. I'm going to be changing the attribute colours now because the yellow really shows off just how good he is compared to some of the other players that we've got on the team. Uh, yeah, comes in. Uh, free transfers. Previously been at Wolves, so got a bit of pedigree. Brad Carr, welcome. Next up, probably one of my better defenders, although while he does have slightly better balance, double the previous guy, uh, he's got two strength, which is a problem. But again, the heading, marking, tackling attributes, the pace, he's got good positioning. Probably going to be one of our better defenders. Billy Holmes, welcome to the side. Uh, previously of Derby County and more recently Ebb's Fleet. Uh, hasn't played for a couple of seasons, according to this database. So um, he's got a chance to prove himself. He'll be fine, probably, viewers. Probably. Sam Hanna is up next. Uh, Decent-ish left-back option. Again, really pacey. Six foot three could probably be a decent centre-back. But yeah, that, that nine tackling is all I really require at this level. Backup left-back, just to get us a little bit more depth. Uh, we're still in need of a right-back, really. Right-back's a problem. And finally, a man, again, to sit in the middle of this midfield. Uh, Wilson Chingonka, I think, is going to be probably one of the better players for me. Again, really good decision-making. Acceleration's going to be great, too. Tackling, passing, wins the ball back. Work great of 10 in this division is pretty good some of the work rates as you've seen have been a little underwhelming so in comes Wilson Chingonka and how does he fit in to the rest of the side let's take a look okay so when you look at the squad list with the with the 11 now and I've introduced you to a few of the players and we of course in goal uh, Solomon Conta is our only capable is a, is a, is a compliment uh, right back hopefully he's going to be hopefully he's going to be fine I mean fine for this first game that we're playing uh, Billy Holmes and Ryan New then the new back partnership back partnership centre-back partnership. Uh, on the left-hand side, George uh, Comerford, of course, who came uh, with the side as we found them. Not the quickest, so if Pacey right-wingers are getting up against him, that could be a problem. Uh, sitting in front of him, then we mentioned him, uh, Chingonka will be the sort of the deeper player in this system. Uh, Brad Carr and Belho will be in the centre. Manny will be on the right-hand side. Uh, O'Reilly will be playing on the left-hand side, probably cutting in a little bit. He's more right-footed, so I think more right-footed, very right-footed. Um, so he's probably going to be cutting in a little bit more than playing a winger role. And then we've got uh, David Hoey up front, who I think going to be a bit of a star again you can see that 14 finishing i please please do something pre-season's not gone brilliantly for david uh no goals in five appearances um not not great from david come on david okay so team wise fixture or, or the way the team are going to look set up um it says they're custom gig and press I've, I've basically said gig and press and then i've made it a less intense gig and press which makes it not really a gig and press because that's sort of the point of the gig and press so we're going to start with this of course we'll see how the team develops the further we go into the season of course heroes are there to be made the bench is looking strong in terms of potential if we can develop those boys a little bit in this first season then hopefully things will go away well for us having made those acquisitions to the side the season preview we've risen a little bit up to 13th so still not great but not bad. Uh, to give you an idea, looking at guys like Ogo Obi, he's a cut above some of my players. On the other side, Shamar Moore, again, he's much better than my players. And hopefully this first season, of course I'd love to get promoted, but I think staying in the division, setting ourselves up for the season after that with free transfers again, is the way to go. But we've got to get to know these boys. So let's play a match. Let's find out what they're all about. Uh, so far, we've had five friendlies. We've drawn one of the games against Slough. The rest of them were unimpressive. Here we go. When you're losing to the second 11, you know you've got a few issues at the, at the club. That was before the signings, though. All right, then. The pitching in Esterman League South Central Division. Barking our opposition. Let's see if they're in the doghouse. That works. It took a while, but it worked. I just love... I'm, right, I'm seeing it now, viewers. I'm so excited because I know that the lower leagues of England are crackers so this is going to be fun for me jingonka and brown are struggling I'm calling him i can't sorry manny i know you've got a surname and i respect that but i've got to change it he won't mind there's no there's no manny manny everyone knows him as manny all right then here we go did i just skip the team talk oh for the right it's not gone brilliantly all right it's a new save so we're just going to change a few bits and pieces for those that are curious as to what i use i go for telly i go uh with our tv i go for key highlights on this occasion uh we zoom in a little bit more and we lower that height a little bit and there we are like you see everyone's winning xg in the lower divisions how is this going to be tier eight remember viewers we're starting at um we could get relegated and go down a little bit but hopefully well hopefully we don't uh we'll just up the speed of this just a touch as well right then we're locked in as um are we gonna see manny's very small it looks like i don't think manny's that small in 
in real life. I might have to contact him about that. As uh, the new outing, you can see the stadium there looking absolutely fantastic. And the kit as well, a sensation. Of course, a few people asking about kits. Um, if there's a big demand for them, then of course, we'll release them. There's a car in the side. I don't, should he be a cousin, cousin car? I don't know. We've had a son in the previous save, so whether we call him a cousin or not, I don't know. I'm watching there's a lot of the ball around here, by the way. And this is this is really quite something. Look at us look at us shift it. Look at us move it. Bellho's on it now. He's about forty yards out. Hoey, this is a big chance. Oh, he's hit the po he's hit both posts. He's hit the if that doesn't sum up my life as a manager. He's in the, in the first chance we've had, my striker's hit both posts. Corner played in, the keeper does well. West Astuti. Yep, it's another corner though. Comerford, that left foot, that wonderful left foot from Comerford. Hoey's there. Oh, David Hoey with the goal. That's what we're talking about. A first of the season. Great corner from Comerford, who's deciding to celebrate very much on his own over there. Didn't try and run in with the rest of the group. He just sort of went back to the corner flag and sort of said, thanks, corner flag. Thanks for being a part of this. As uh, the corner there, whipped in. He's not really been marked. I say he's not been marked. He's sort of in between two defenders. Heads in and... Uh, AFC Thames lead. Green plays it short to Seymour. Oh, I, was, I, was, I was having such a lovely time. Let's not ruin it now. Ball out to that side. Tweeds on it. Cool name. Seymour back out to going. Is it going to go out wide? It is Bruce. I'm just hoping we can contain them. I don't know how good they're going to be. This is the thing. The first sort of 10 games or so, we'll start to discover just how good we are. Of course, winning this first game with David Hoey, who lost out to the header there, is going to be key. I think if we can get a win on our first game as manager... That's perfect. That's just what we're looking for. The Premier League, for those curious, don't doesn't start for a little while, of course. They're adhering to um, rules that are set in the first year of the game, of course, with what's going on globally as this series comes out. Um, I'm sure you can agree it's going to be a different save this this first season as uh, Burkane plays it forward. They're knocking it around quite nicely. We've just stopped and he scored a volley. So we've just stopped, boys. What's this cameraman looking at as well? He's looking at nothing. The action's... What's he focusing on? He's focusing on me. Burkane plays it forward. It's headed It's headed down. And then on the somehow green on the... It's a great goal, actually. It's annoyingly good. I mean, defensively there, we're all sort of arms like that. Just, oh, sorry, boys. Yeah, not great, everybody. Come on. We scored the first goal, and I felt pretty good about it. Are we leading on XG right now, viewers? We are. So this is... This isn't very fair. It's Darbo. Goes back to Burkane. Ever since we scored, they've had... He's got to be off. <laughs> I love... It's over and he was off. Of course, the key thing as well, checking out who are going to be the big sides in this division in the first season, where the big results are potentially going to come from. Because all, for all we know, Barking are either one of the best sides in the division or they're not. So <laughs> we'll find out at some stage as the ball to Belho. Again, just winning here, boys, would be great. So let's, let's try and make that happen, shall we? They're passing it around like... They are a pre like a Premier League side. I can't. I, we can't get near them here, boys. Can we? Maybe we need to up the intensity for you. <laughs> They're just knocking it around. Anybody? I mean, the ball's played in, crossed in. Holmes gets there, and uh, Oriodun or Oriodun. I think it's Oriodun. I think I'm saying it correctly for a change. As uh, he's on it, ball forward to Howie. Here we go. This is our man. This is our main guy. He's in on goal, and he finishes. Slots two nil. David Howie is going to be. A star. Take him to the Premier League, Ben. All the way. Lovely jubbly. There he is. Look. It's, a, it's a lovely ball forward by Reardon. Or Reardon, I should say. Hoey's first touch, really, really good. And the finish into that bottom corner. The keeper tries to kick it away with his legs. It's like when you ask someone to go in goal who's not normally a goalkeeper and they just use their legs for like 90% of it. He's on 8.1. 8.2. He's flying. They've got a corner. Green plays it in. We head it clearish back to him. Uh, puts the ball in again. Goings there. It's a goal fest, viewers. It's, it's an opening day goal fest. By the way, we have packed it out for our opening game. Now, I think that the attendance on the first game is usually a lot higher than the rest of it. So, this is lovely, though. If, you, if you've turned up today, viewers, in the comment section, maybe if you'd have to like, you've been given a ticket. I don't know. But, um, yeah, flying. Look at that. You're, you're packed in there. You're still, you're, most of you are stood up as well, which I respect. Right, half time. Thames two. Barking two. And uh, lots of work to do. Right, Ryan New. Uh, I'll just take my right back on a 6.1 viewers. A 6.1. Oh, oh, Comerford. Com Comerford, I'll tell you what, Comerford can't run, but his, his defending doesn't look too bad. Is that over to the right side? Oh, God, my right back has to do something. This is scary. And now, on it now, where's he going to go? He, he comes backwards to Tweed. He plays it back to Thompson. Forward to... I mean, this, the game is on... The edge. There's Michael Emery. Look at that. The crowd are loving it. The crowd are... Oh, I am personally loving it. Big shout out to him for the intro as well yesterday. It's superb from him. Oh, what a ball as well. An assist to his name, maybe. Hoey's in on goal. Michael to Hoey. He's got another chance. He's kicked it in. Oh, that means Emery doesn't get the assist. But a goal. 3-2. 14 minutes gone. The crowd are going absolutely wild, viewers.
Look at that from Michael Emery. That is superb. What a clearance over the top of the defenders who are left stationary. Hoey's gone in on goal. And the finish is, well, the first one's not particularly good. The second one, though, composed. Up the Thames, viewers. Come on. We've wasted money on a big screen there, in my opinion. We didn't need that. That's I don't know who's in charge. Of, probably Brian. Not, not, don't need it. All right, they're coming forward, they're barking, and they're doing so with some ability. Although Comerford there, the touch from that winger wasn't particularly good. Hoey's on it. I do feel there's going to be a lot of goals. Hoey's gone again. You've got to play him through, maybe no. Oroiden's going himself. Where's he going to go? He's going to have to cross it in. He does do. Hoey's there. Oh, it's their own goal. It's an own goal. He's been given the goal. How does he get the goal for that? How? Right. He's crossed it in. It's, it, it's, I mean, the angle's there. Gary with a great goal as... Um, He's been given that. This defender, is it, is it the, on the back of the head, it's 4 2. We're leading 4 2. 20 minutes left. Is there going to be another chance for us? We go third in the table if things stay like this. Viewers. Oh, fifth now. We've dropped down quickly. As soon as I mentioned it, basically. Ball played in. Keep it away. I don't need any I don't need any first day drama viewers. We don't need it. I'm very happy with my acquisitions and uh and, and players brought in. I'm very happy with everything. Oh, oh my word, defending, defending. Forward again. I mean our uh, right backs, it doesn't exist. Michael Emery is a I mean, clap him, viewers, clap that's exceptional. Emery, he's on fire. You've only scored two goals, Emery. It doesn't work, viewers. It does not work. Man is gonna get there. What's Manny going to... Oh, he keeps it in well. Is he going to look for a pass forward? He's going to go himself. Well, that's a good highlight. I should probably make a change. I'll take my right back off, but I don't have any other right backs to bring on. Uh, bring on. I'm going to bring uh, Snedden on for Manny on that side. I'm going to bring on Mark Mundy for Hoey. Oh, Hoey's got a hat trick. We'll get him off. Only five minutes left to go. We'll waste a little bit of time as Mark Mundy comes on. I don't know why I said like that every single time. As Hoey could be on for a fourth year. They've cocked it up. He has scored four. He's got a review on his debut. David Hoey is five goals for Thames. Barking in the mud. And his fourth goal of the season. David Hoey's having a lovely time. The reserved Gegen Press viewers. Something that is not... <laughs> It's not something you should be trying at home. It's the part, it's the dream start here against the team in blue as well of all the teams to play. Always on the old blue and white. Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da. Make the tactical changes. Four goals. He should be happy with that. A 9.4 for Hoey. A hero already. As uh, wow, this is this has been fun. If Mark Mundy scores, viewers, then I'm gonna I'm gonna lose my mind. Dadson over there. Um. I wonder if he's a father. You can only assume so. Ball played in, and Michael. Oh God! Oh, it's been disallowed. It, it was a, it was an illegal attempt, Michael. Don't you worry. He was offside. Uh, the goalkeeper for Michael Emery there, not his best work. I, this this season is going to be goal filled. Oh, he's clearly offside. Yeah, we can see that. I can't believe I've actually spotted it. Of course, incorrect decisions with offsides and things can happen in these divisions. There's no VAR, so do bear that in mind. As it's the as I say, viewers, the perfect start. Um, good XG from us as well. Five. Two. Monday got on the got on the pitch as well. Beautiful. Monday, Sunday, happy days. Tuesday, Wednesday, happy days. Thursday, Friday, happy days. Saturday, Mark Monday, he's going to score goals for you. Dun, 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 dun. These days are... Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. But there we are. Look at that. Second in the table. Oh, viewers, would you just look at it? Of course, there's no real transfer window with free transfers as well. So throughout this, we can do all sorts. Manny's made his professional debut. He's got a rapturous ovation. He's loved it. And we've announced that just on the back of that win, viewers, a 5K per annual uh, main kit sponsor, which, well, that's... Hang on, who is the sponsor? Me, I'm the sponsor. What the? F oh, God. To be fair, look at them. They look good, don't they? Look at them. But that is going to wrap things up, viewers. If you enjoyed it, do drop a like on it. Let's aim for a big total again. I won't even set you a challenge. Let's just see how high it can go. And I'll see you again tomorrow. We love with care. For me, let's mention until next time, Thames are back and red. I'll see you again soon. Goodbye.